Okay, good morning everybody, at last. Uh, welcome to Valencia. Um, my name is Tom Kivlin, I'm a principal cloud architect at Vodafone, um, and I'm just going to do an overview of a few things um, and a bit of audience participation. Hopefully it will work for the people in the room and on the live stream. So hello to you on the live stream, thank you for joining us. Um, for those of you who might be watching and joining us later today, we're in Pavilion 3, Room E, which is on Level 2. Um, we've got a couple of breaks during the day, um, one this morning, one this afternoon, and they will be taking place in the foyers outside here. Um, also, lunch is shared with the other Colo events, um, again, outside here. Um, and then later on, we've got a happy hour and events reception, um, and Priyanka, the, uh, the, the leader of the CNCF, will be joining us there. Um, there's a Slack channel where all attendees can join and ask questions. Um, we've got some people from the programme committee on there who will help corral those questions and help them get answered. For those of you who haven't seen the signs around, there's some event Wi-Fi. Um, there's a few of us have found you need to try a few times, potentially, uh, to get there. Um, I won't go through the whole schedule because we're, we're running a few minutes late, but there's some amazing looking uh, um, sessions going on. Um, the, um, there's, a, there's a micro survey that's been launched by the CNCF, which is focused on telcos. So whether you're an operator or vendor um, or someone else in the ecosystem, um, I'd um, strongly urge you to go and take that survey. Um, and then there's also, this week on Wednesday, I believe, there's going to be the launch of the new CNF certification program. So today, soft launch. Um, but on Wednesday, um, there'll be an official announcement about that, um, which should be quite exciting. So now I want to get into some audience participation. Um, so for all, all of you, whether you're in the room or online, if you go to ahaslides.com slash cntelco day or sc scan this QR code um, then I can get you to answer some questions and rather than doing a show of hands which can only be for those in the room we'll get some some participation from everyone who's online um, so hopefully we should see the number in the bottom go up a little uh, to show that people are joining um, <coughs> So apologies for starting late this morning. We had a couple of technical issues. I hope those of you on the live stream, the, the slides look okay. There's a potential that the colors are a bit funny. Right, so the first question that I'd like to ask is who you're representing. So I'd normally like to start by asking, you know, who's here from an operator, who's here from a vendor, who's here from a, you know, a telco services consumer or someone else, you know, you might just be interested in telco stuff, um, or you might be, a, you know, from a, um, an analyst firm or something. So, um, I have to unlock it. There we go, so, let's see how that goes. Be interesting to see. Okay, so we've got nearly, nearly 50 people logged in, which is good. And a nearly equal split between operators and vendors. That's interesting. Uh, quite a lot of someone else. That'd be interesting to find out who that is during the day. Um, next question is where you've come from. Uh, so, um, where in the world? It's up to you how specific you want to be. <laughs> be interesting to see how far people have travelled. Loads, loads of them. Okay, so we've got some from the States, some from Peru, this is great. It's good to see a different split of people. Okay, um, so then the, the next one is 
So today we've got loads of talks about um, cloud native telco applications, cloud native telco platforms, um, you know, very detailed technology um, sessions, you know, some really good looking lightning talks. It'd be good to understand people's level of familiarity with the various topics that are being talked about today. Um, and then we can review that at the end of the day. And we can see, you know, the people, you know, feeling that they've got something from the day. Um, so this gives us, a, oh, let me unlock it again. Uh, this should give us a good idea of the audience kind of knowledge level. Um, so pretty high by the look of it across quite a few of the topics. Okay, so the last question, I think, um, is to get people's input on what is a cloud native network function. Um, so those of you who have been around the arena for a while will know that that's a question that probably takes quite a lot of discussion to answer. Um, so it'd be interesting get, to get people's input on that. And again, we can we can see if the answer changes throughout the day. Oh. I've just unlocked it again, so. <laughs> Something that is not a VM ported into a container. Yeah, I think there's some, there's some experience talking there, I think. Okay, some really interesting answers here. A couple of, couple of mentions of 12 factors. Okay, yeah, implemented as a microservice. Application providing network related functionalities. That sounds like someone's, that, that sounds like someone's copied it from our white paper. <laughs> the holy grail. <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> Oh, it's not scrolling on this screen, that's weird. Apologies. I thought it would scroll on that screen. Okay, some interesting, interesting, um, interesting answers there. Good, right, well, anyway, so um, that's good to get that input, so thank you for that. Um, like I say, this was just a welcome session. I think up next, um, in uh, eight minutes, we'll have the first session of the day. Uh, so until then, there's some drinks outside um, and we should be ready to go in, uh, in eight minutes. Thank you very much. Have a good day. <laughs>